Arnab, it's a pleasure to have you. Same here. Great organization, great conference. I had the pleasure of interviewing two of your colleagues before you. Okay. Uh, it was uh, a big challenge coming oh, yes. out of the pandemic. You know, whether we'll be okay to put this out, how will people react, how will they accept and all that. All those things were there. But what matters is at the end of the day, the conference was successful. People were happy. People are still hanging around. <laughs> people are so, 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 so your take on that, you know, uh, the apprehensions and where we are today. Okay. Yes, as you said, it was a big concern. Uh, and as you probably even know by now, until about three, three and a half weeks ago, we were less than 60% of where we are today in terms of attendee. That's a big deal because you just don't know how to plan it if you're 400 people or if you're 700 people. So it was a big, it was good news that eventually it picked up. We have like close to 750 people registering, but it was challenged to change plan every three days to what we are going to be planning for. So there's a lot of learning but you know at the end of the day we had a very good conference people are still hanging around this is what time almost past seven o'clock it was a great success but a lot of effort goes into making this conference right it's a good teamwork support of the board members uh you know and reaching out bringing sponsors yes. even at this stage etc yes. so uh, uh, some some thoughts on how it all came together yeah it was a big challenge the board you know their board members are volunteers also, right? It's not a job. So they have their full-time job and then they have to do this. So not everybody is, uh, you know, lined up to do it sometimes what is needed to be done. But they're trying. So every, the intent is good, but sometimes, you know, the feasibility, the practicality is not good. So it was a challenge to pull it through. Uh, but again it's a volunteer job so whatever everybody did i'm appreciative of that and i try to do as much as i could do and volunteers i'm telling you meaning the volunteers who are on the day or even like a few days before i'm telling you there's no more bigger value than that that's i really appreciate that i sometimes like try to find an answer why they do what they do right i don't think like i've ever done that honestly so that's my thing. Thank you to the volunteers. You know, they just come up and do and they don't enjoy the conference and they are doing a thankless job. Hardly anybody knows about them. That's phenomenal. You know, I wish I could be like one of them. Absolutely. You know, it's a very great point. It's a thankless job, but volunteers the key. These are all volunteer driven organizers. Yes. Without them, you wouldn't have built all this, right? From content all the way to the execution right. part of it. But uh, beyond that, uh, in terms of value that we create for the ecosystem, yes. the whole purpose of this conference is to A, to bring the networking together, yes. but also build a lot of content. Yes. So people can take it home yes. with the current trends, technologies, yes. leadership lessons and all that. Yeah. So some thoughts on that? Oh, absolutely. So this year, you know, I'm kind of involved um, in this new. I have not been involved in this organization. And I, I'm really proud of something that I did. I was able to pull it off. That we were able to put some totally new uh, topic on the table that we haven't, like the tech industry is really not been talking about, that our sustainability, our opening keynote speaker, you know, that was, I would say, and everybody later on and came, they said, I want that recording, I want that recording, can you send me his presentation? I was even skeptic that he wouldn't be appreciated. So I'm really so, you know, thankful that people th re related to what I wanted to bring in. This was really, you know, I, I had to personally work hard to make that keynote happen, okay? So that's number one. And there are lots of other, you know, getting speakers lined up with the right topic, it's a biggest challenge. Right? Sponsorship is another biggest challenge, but that's a money issue. But to build the content and, and build the content without a relationship with money is the challenge. And I think we were able to strike a right balance of that. We, yes, there were some money content, but there are lots of non-money content. And this day, that's why it got a little packed, but it still ended like 15 minutes late. That I would say an achievement for a nine hour conference, okay, with 30 plus speakers. Amazing. I'm proud of myself and the board and the volunteers that we have pulled through. There are lots of problems that happened along the way and that's only normal for an event like this with involving 600 plus people. 
But at the end of the day, I think we are a great one. No, I think it's true, you know, like you and like other people, they have great feedback from people. See, at the end of the day, what happens is the, the customer is happy with your product, that's what matters. Yes. Problems are always there, but that is what the, the, the right. internal team sees that. Right. But at the end of the day, you know, it was achieved. Yeah. So again, uh, thank you for yes. the opportunity. And on behalf of all these people who I have to, spoken to, uh, congratulations to you and to thank the you. entire team for a fabulous job. You know, well done. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. I think.